Hello, it's Melinda from Alexis and Melinda's Art Space. I'm doing um, day two of a art journaling habit in November, so you art journal every day. And I'm sort of succeeding, I'm a few days behind, but other things have got in the way. I didn't think I'd be able to do it every day. Um, so this is day two. I kept up to about day eight, but just didn't get the videos edited because I was having too much fun playing my art journal. So these are going to be sort of quick uh, pages. Um, but some do take a while. <laughs> Great plans go astray. So I'm working in my Altered Atlas book. Um, I love the size of this book. It's about a 12 inch page when you open it to a double spread like it is. And I just love the skinny format um, if I'm doing a single page. So I love working in altered books. So I do have a couple of videos on my channel about how to alter books and get them ready to be used. So I grabbed a whole lot of um, there's Montmark crayons there, water soluble ones, there's twistables and there's even a gelato, they're basically all the same, it's like buying tomato sauce at Coles, Safeway, it used to be Safeway now it's Woolworths, an IGA, an Audi, basically same thing, different packet, good way to explain it. So just blending it with a baby wipe because they're water soluble, they do blend really nicely with, with water, or I find a baby wipe is awesome because you're only getting a small amount of water, as you can see the baby wipes aren't very wet didn't even add any more water to it and was just able to smooth over the colours. Now this particular prompt every day there is a word prompt and this particular day two they're all ge randomly generated um, and this one is voyage and I decided to do a bit interesting on this one. Um, I grabbed some long forgotten washi tape. I've actually been rediscovering my washi tape this um, this art journaling of habit series which is fantastic I do have one or two rolls okay add a few zeros to that number that I told you if I don't say that loud it won't be true I have a washi addiction so does my daughter so I found this road washi tape and I thought oh great I'll do a road through the middle of my page hence why I'm also working on my atlas book and I didn't actually cover up the atlas because I wanted the atlas or the road map underneath underneath can't talk, what are the words? Underneath the show through. So what I'm wanting to do with, it was a pain to keep finding the edge of the washi. Alexis is bringing me something to look at. I have no idea what it was. Probably maths homework. Um, yes, yeah, so the washi was a pain to get at the um, off the roll. Some of my washi tape is getting quite old, so I do need to use it up. Because some rolls do become unsticky or sticky that you can't get them off. Okay, off the washi tangy. Because it is old washi, and usually with washi anyway, I like to, I just think I like to say the word washi at the moment. I like to put a coat of um, some sort of glue underneath and on top. So I am using some Mod Podge, matte medium Mod Podge. Um, not my favourite, I prefer my Liquitex um, matte medium, but um, I did get this on special. So I'm a bit of a price snob rather than a brand snob. Then I decided that my road looked really funny going across the page with nothing around the edge. So I continued to do some more washi. Told you I do lose lots of washi in these art journal habits. So it's not too late to jump on the art journal habit of joy of sharing um, prompts. You can do them at any time. You can even do them in December. It's just about a challenge they do each November and it's about art journaling every day. It's about getting into a habit of art journaling. Um, life's just been interesting, I'll put it that way, the last few weeks and I've really enjoyed the time I've been sitting down and art journaling, I really needed this time and I haven't art journaled for a while before this, um, September, October have been interesting months and I just haven't got back into my art journaling and I so miss it, I so just pl I love playing and with a word prompt I find I'm better and get more direction of where my page will go if I've got a prompt or something to start with. I find if I just start art journaling on my own, I am an arm and procrastinate too much. I really don't know what I want to do. But I'm finding even with it just a word prompt, I have a direction, I have an idea, and I come up with a page. It, some of them are quite silly, you'll see them, and I'm sure you'll comment that they are quite silly and ridiculous. But hey, I really don't care. <laughs> I'm having fun. They're just drying off the Liquitex. Uh, not Liquitex, that was Mod Podge. That Mod Podge. I do like to seal the water soluble crayons as well. So 
So I went to my computer and decided to get some words. Now I should have grabbed my book so I had the words in front of me. Bear with me one second. I'm out of habit of doing voiceovers, so usually I have the page open in front of me um, because it's very hard to see the page when I am doing it on the screen. Now, there is the page. Here we go. So the words I've done on the computer, I would have used my Dino label writer. I've got one of those ones that prints out stickers, but I've used up all the stickers, so went on my laser printer and put along the middle. Your voids can take you the long way around and that's scattered up through the middle and down the bottom it says but you always reach the same destination in the end and that just summed up that week of my life I'm just I, I don't know do, is it just me or do I just have to do things the hard the damn hard way lately or just have things take like 10 times as long as they should seriously some days I wonder someone just looks at my life and goes let's just make it really really difficult for this person to go from this spot to this spot um, so a lot of these art journal pages are reflecting what's going on in my life even though it's not literal and this one did sum up um, the last couple of weeks of my life and it's just seriously 2019 is going to have to be better than 2018 can't get much worse put it that way without revealing much too much personal stuff. Not that major things have gone wrong, but just <sighs> little things just add up to be annoying. So that's about all that I do to the art journal page. So I do have some still photos coming up at the end. I was just having a look at the page. I just threw my book on the couch. My desk, if you saw my desk, it's an absolute mess. I've been crafting up a storm. But that's okay. I, I should get into the habit, good habit to get into, is clean up my desk after I finish a project. No, I just go and get the next project and pile more crap on my desk and then wonder why I'm working in a very, very small area when I have a whole trestle table to work on. Right. So I finished up the wording and giving that a dry and that's about it. I've got some still photos at the end. As I said, um, I will link the ladies channel I'll link Chelsea's channel Chelsea channel below that I first discovered this idea of art journal habit 2018 or google that hashtag and you'll find everyone else is participating I will endeavor to get more videos up quicker and I'm determined to get this finished even if it takes me till the end of December thanks for watching bye for now